Sometimes you may wish to generate a list of checks sorted by the order things were posted, by the post date as opposed to the print date. This could be especially helpful if you do accrual accounting. I'm going to do that by going to Reports and creating a new view under Data Viewer. Uh, you'll see I'm under the Expenses and Ledger section, and I'm starting with the default view called Vendor Information Check Detail. And then I'll choose some dates over here. I'm just going to pick uh, the starting and ending dates of May. I'll click Create, and then I'll give this view a title. So I'll call this Vendor Checks by Post Date. And then I'm going to uh, choose the fields I want to include on the report. Notice what happens here in the background when I say none. All the fields that are selected go away, and then I can pick the ones that I really want to include. So I would like the vendor's name to be on the report, and then I'm going to scroll down a bit here, and I want, I want to choose some other things. I would like the date yet and was posted. I may also want to see the print date, uh, probably the check number, maybe the GL account number, description, and probably the amount of the check. And I'll close that. So I've got all those fields here. Now I can easily sort by any of the headings. So if I want these ordered by the date things were posted, I can click once on the post date heading, and that will give me the order from the oldest to the newest for that month. Uh, and then if I click a second time, I now have the reverse order. So I now have the most recent entries showing on top. You'll notice that some print dates might say 1900 as the year. If you see that, uh, and or a negative one check number, that indicates a check that you have posted but not yet printed. So those would be things waiting in your batch print queue. And that's all there is to creating a data view to sort by post date. You'd simply click save and exit and now that new custom view you've created will be available for future use. Thank you.